countdown underway for match 41. And our match is underway. Right off the bat, Donut Jonut going for all of the initiation line power cells for the Red Alliance. Jet 2928 and Taco Troll going for the ones for the Blue Alliance. We've got rapid fire power cells into the power ports. Red Alliance with the slight edge in the early moments of our match, 62 to 58. But we've seen throughout our competition, these leads go back and forth, depending on how fast these robots can fire. And already Adam D and Jet 2928 for the Blue Alliance changing things and getting a lead going for the Blue Alliance. A little bit of a tussle between Donut Jonut and Taco Troll. Donut Jonut ultimately respawns because of contact for five five seconds in that territory. During that respawn, there's also a 15 point penalty assessed against an alliance. More contact taking place this time between Donut Jonut and Adam D. Those two robots back off each other before there's any kind of respawn. Silverhawk now respawning for the Red Alliance. One minute and 20 seconds remaining. Blue Alliance building a lead, 167 to 118. Adam D working to make that lead even bigger. Donut Jonut firing into the power port, getting a little bit of defense played against them by Jet 2928 of the Blue Alliance. Jet goes up on their hind wheels, pushed away by Andrew F. A massive blow. Ultimately, that Blue Alliance bot respawning making space for Donut Jonut and Andrew F to fire into the power port. Blue Alliance is still in the lead, but the Red Alliance closing that gap. 181 for the Red Alliance, 213 for Blue. 40 seconds remaining in qualification match number 41. Andrew F, trench run for the Red Alliance under the control panel. They're firing into the power port. Most of their shots making it into the inner port. End game period underway. Like we've been seeing all evening, teams trying to wait until the last possible moment to head to their rendezvous points, trying to score their last few power cells. Neither red nor blue with 90 scored power cells at this point. That just changed for the Blue Alliance. 90 scored power cells on the nose. That does mean the Blue Alliance will be earning a ranking point guaranteed by energizing their shield generator switch. It looks like both alliances may also be getting ranking points for their shield generator operational status. We'll wait for the final scores to see if they earn that bonus ranking point. Final scores incoming, the win going to the Blue Alliance, 378 to 333. The Blue Alliance pulling off a perfect match, two ranking points from their win, a bonus ranking point from their endgame, and a bonus ranking point by scoring exactly 90 power cells, what they needed. Red Alliance not going home empty-handed, they well earn one ranking point for scoring 75 points during the endgame period. Thanks for watching. If you want more fun content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. You can also directly help support fun by visiting our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Thanks to all of our co-executive producers on Patreon and tier two plus subscribers on Twitch keeping fun loud, live, and independent.